Jordan, I want to throw a hypothetical out here for you. Um, we were talking about, you know, Cody could have cut Derek to get to, you know, the end and potentially win. If you were ever put in a situation where you were up against Jeff in the final three, would you have ever, ever considered cutting Jeff to, you know, potentially win the game? To be honest, probably not because he was like my best friend in the house. And I probably, cause I went over this scenario uh, when I made it to the final four, I was like, what if it comes down and it's me, Rachel and Adam. And I go, am I gonna let Adam go or am I gonna let Rachel go? And if we were in the final, I would have um, I would have got rid of Adam and taken Rachel because she, even though I knew I'd probably lose against her, I was like, it's 50, 50, you know, I don't know how people are going to vote. They're going to be like, she was the comp beast or she had a good social game, but I felt like she was my friend throughout the show. And I was like, I can't cut her. I always feel bad. I just, and that's why big brother, I'm not good at that. I'm not good at being cutthroat because I love my friends and I love just being with people. That's why I'm hosting a party at my house. And I just love good people. And I feel like good people attract good people like Shane. And um, I just, I don't know, friends, money, money's nothing. You know, like I was not saying it's not, I mean, the, the government takes half of it anyways, but I'm saying being 22 years old with half a million dollars, well, it really wasn't half a million, but I just feel like, um, I just cherish friendships over anything. Money's nothing. I knew what it was like to buy whatever I want, buy a new car, buy this. I kept, I had a Honda, an 03 Honda I got in um, high school and I kept it. And it was so funny because when I went back home, everybody I knew was looking, can you shut the door? Everyone was looking, people are starting to come in. Everyone was um, looking to see what I drove. And yeah. I would like pull up in my 03 Honda with a <laughs> spoiler on the back. And I never bought a new car and I kept it till I was 26. And I got so many tickets in LA that I shipped it back to North Carolina and then sold <laughs> it to a friend of mine, her cousin who was in college and needed a car. So yeah, but like, for 10 times more than it was worth because you were the champion of Big Brother. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I know. You listen, signed it. I called her Rhonda the Honda was my car. That was oh, the name. Rhonda the Honda. And, and it was you're pulling up to red car. carpets in Rhonda the Honda. <laughs> you're like, it was uh, so, it was the best car. But I'm just saying, like, money doesn't mean anything. I mean, money doesn't, I know it's so cliche to say that, but it doesn't make you happy. You could have all this money because at the end of the, I had $500,000 and no, I wasn't rich, but I had cushion, but it didn't, I still felt the same, you know? Yeah. You still have like the same feelings and everything. Yeah, it helps you get further in life, but um, I would much rather have friends than money. And I know that's that. cliche, but I think that's why you're America's favorite player. No, I'm not. Twice. Pump <laughs> me up. Twice. I appreciate it, Shane. 